A vigil will be held tonight for a Norwalk mother who is now taking refuge in a New Haven church. Last week, she was set to be deported back to her native Guatemala. Supporters will be gathering at that church very soon. News 8's Mario Boone is there live with a preview. Mario. Well, in just under an hour, advocates will gather here to hold a vigil for keeping uh, Nuri Shavaria in the country. And just within the past 30 minutes, we got word that both uh, mayors from both New Haven and Norwalk will be here at this church to attend the vigil. Now, we've been telling you about this story since last Thursday when Shavaria took sanctuary inside this church rather than follow federal orders to leave the U.S. and return to her native Guatemala. While here, the mother of four has been visited by Governor Malloy and several members of Connecticut's congressional delegation. Advocates plan to use tonight's vigil to turn up the pressure on federal immigration leaders and the Trump administration to force them to grant Shavaria a reprieve. Now, supporters say despite coming to America illegally 24 years ago, she's been a model citizen by staying out of trouble and holding down a job. I don't think it's right. I mean, um, basically, we're all immigrants here. Um, we're all brought here or forced here or came here. And that was uh, the New Haven City Alder uh, Frank Douglas there speaking out uh, about this case. Now, we just got word also that a music group from Los Angeles will be here to perform at that vigil. Of course, we'll be here as well monitoring what's going on. We'll have a live report on the very latest in this case tonight at 10 and 11. Reporting from New Haven, I'm Mario Boone, News 8.